Okay, we begin with a story you're going to see only on two school buses in Santa Fe ISD outfitted with cameras on the outside. Yes, yeah, some are questioning the technology. KPRC2 investigator Joel Eisenbaum looking into that camera controversy tonight. Joel, people are getting tickets because of those cameras. And Keith, Santa Fe ISD says, look, this is all in the name of student safety. It just may be. Take it at face value. But they are doling out some pretty hefty fines. And some people say in some cases, I didn't deserve that fine. And we've got a piece of video tonight that may support that point of view. Santa Fe in Galveston County is a small town. About 13,000 live here. But the technology they're using on their school buses in the name of keeping kids safe is cutting edge if not controversial. You don't believe the ticket was issued fairly? No, absolutely not. Not at all. And how much was the ticket for? $315. $315. Did you pay it? I did. On a handful of specially outfitted school buses, a completely automated system is taking video of suspected scoff loss blowing through school bus stop signs. But watch, the owner of this vehicle got a ticket even though it appears the sign extends as she's driving by. Is that fair? It's for the children, and I agree with that, but it, it should be implemented correctly to stop the perpetrator. In fact, because license plate reading is at the heart of this system, it's the owner of the vehicle, not necessarily the driver, who gets the $300 ticket. The city passed an ordinance allowing the district to do that. Uh, the infraction that does not go on your driving record and is managed by a for-profit company that Santa Fe ISD shares revenue with. It's very similar to the red light cameras that state law abolished in 2019. We couldn't find anybody Friday, including lawyers and lawmakers, who think Santa Fe ISD is breaking the law. The district declined an on-camera interview Friday, but sent us a long statement. Here's the crux. Our goal is that we do not receive revenue, but ensure the safety of our children entering and exiting our buses. We encourage individuals who are issued a citation to go through an appeals process that allows for contesting the citation. Santa Fe ISD also tells us that they do have a police officer who reviews each and every one of these cases, the video and the pictures has had a deterrent effect because they are issuing less tickets. In 2019, it was 169 violations per month. This year, they're down to 74. We're live in Santa Fe. That's Galveston County. I'm Joel Eisenbaum, KPRC, 2 News.